we are actually targeting milliseconds in terms of where everything has to line up perfectly. Precision is key and repeatability is key. The challenge was the two autonomous trucks coming from the distance, driving towards each other, and at the same time a car towing a bicyclist was coming 90 degrees angles towards the truck, and the bicyclist was jumping through the open trailers of the trucks. I think the benefit with autonomous trucks is just how precise they can actually be, and uh, you have the ordinary embedded software that's been in these trucks for a long time, but then we also have this new AI technology, we have so many different sensors and so on and it's constantly evolving. We are seeing new things coming in almost on a monthly basis where progress into AI is really pushing us. We are really going to see this uh, technology more and more public uh, in the near future. We work together with, with Plus AI, our technology partner for autonomous driving, and we are really working together as one big team. We are challenging each other in a very positive way. We are building on each other's trust and we are really pushing our technology together forward to make that happen. So a lot of work was done in simulation. You run hundreds and thousands of times. You see the pattern. You do tens and hundreds of tests in live tests to verify the results you observed in simulation are valid in real test. And then you go for it. Autonomous tricks are safe because they are consistent and reliable. It's down to that precision and, and if we are thinking about it and transferring that precision into real life and with that making road traffic, making road transport safer and more efficient. I'm super proud. I'm super proud of the whole team pulling that off. Impressed I wouldn't say because I know that technology for a while and I know what we together are capable of doing. So that precision, that technology, will enable much safer trucks on the road in the future.